I don't believe this is real leather, but you get this nice special set thing. This What is up, Joe Crew? It is me, Joku DMD, and today I have a box from. Guess you're, you're never gonna guess where it's from. No, you know, it's from Japan. This is a box from Japan of Dragon Ball Heroes 11th Anniversary Binder Box Cards. I don't really totally know what's in here, but the. 10th anniversary of Dragon Ball Heroes stuff was really, really cool. So I figured I'd get the 11th anniversary stuff and see what's inside and share it here on my channel. If you are new and you want to see Dragon Ball, One Piece, Demon Slayer, whatever stuff, ship them. There's a subscription button down there and there's also a giveaway going on. If you go to the giveaway video, you could win this custom Joku DMD slabbed, slabbed Joku slab. But until then, just let's check out this ship them. All right. So I'm totally not going to be able to open this thing on camera. So I'm just going to slice them here so i bought this on ebay and i think this is actually just the box that you get if you were to buy this thing straight out and all right cool this is the binder um pretty rad pretty rad and there's a deck box wow this is actually pretty nice all right let's check these things out this deck box is pretty sweet this is like leather Wow, wow, this is nice. And I think this actually fits, I think this would actually possibly fit DBS cards, but if not, very nice Dragon Ball Heroes cards can go in here. This is the Super Dragon Ball Heroes. This red foiling is actually really cool. It's almost like iridescent red foiling. 11th anniversary, Super Dragon Ball Heroes. Rad, nice box. It's got a magnet closure as well. Very, very nice. And then we got the binder here. This also is, like last year, a nice, I don't believe this is real leather, but you get this nice special set thing. It was really cool last year. They did this thing with like the avatars and the character they were based on and there were cards of each one. It was really super rad. But this is this nice collection binder that you get here. And inside there's a stack of cards and sleeves to put them in along with some sleeves for the cards themselves. All right, so you put those pages in and then you get these nice sleeves as well with the 11th anniversary kind of tag there. And then you get some promotional cards as well for your collection. And let's take a look at these shiny things. Wow, they each come pre-packaged. Is this interesting? This is like, well, I'm going to go ahead and strip them these things because I don't care about keeping these in their packaging. But here is a... Here's a Goku and King Piccolo, Kid Goku and King Piccolo. Pretty cool foiling. I'm always, you know, not a huge fan of the uh, shattered glass. Very glad we don't have that in DBS. But here's like, I guess these cards kind of go together because it's Kid Goku and King Piccolo and the opposite on the other side. And I imagine they're going to do the same thing here with this Goku and Frieza. And I bet the next card is going to be Frieza and Goku. Wow, makes sense. Maybe this is like villains and their, and their counterparts and their epic fights. So Frieza and Goku, and this looks like it's going to be Gohan and Cell. And surprise, surprise, it is Gohan and Cell. And then Cell and Gohan. Very rad. This is just kind of going through the Dragon Ball Z story. Actually starting from Dragon Ball because you have King Piccolo there. And then there's Vegito and Boo, and I'm sure that they well, what do we see? It's uh, Boo and Vegito. Very I would have never guessed. And then next we have SS4 Gogeta and Omega Shenron, but it looks like it looks like that's it. They didn't go into Dragon Ball Super, or did they? <laughs> Was I wrong? Wrong again. Oh no, it's just the one. Okay, yeah, we got Omega Shenron and Gogeta in the background there. And then for the last card, it's UI Goku and the avatar that he's sort of based off of. And this must be an avatar card. Yeah, I think it is. This is like a hero card or whatever. Let's go through here and check these again. We got the Goku, Kid Goku and Demon King Piccolo and Demon King Piccolo and Kid Goku. This is, I think this is the part where Goku like turns around and looks at Frieza after he gave him some energy and he's like, you asshole! And he like shh, blasts him and blows Frieza up and calls him an idiot. And there's Frieza trying to jam Goku's dookie in, but it's not going to work out so well for you, bud. Gohan with the father and son Kamehameha and Cell on the receiving end of that before he gets blown to smithereens. And Vegito with the spirit sword. Yeah, the spirit sword is a very, very cool attack. I think it's super rad. And Boo just hugging himself, feeling it out like, yeah, I'm doing the best at this. I get me and all the people that I get to eat inside of me. Gogeta with the high kicks. Is this when he's like, I'm not 
not even going to use my hands. Or does he just not use his hands just to swag out? Or was that Vegeta? I think Vegeta was the one that was like, I'm going to fight you not using my hands. And Omega Shenron, I don't know. I'm not that big of a GT fan. The character design's cool, but the story's kind of... And the UI Goku and his avatar character. Very cool. So this is the 11th anniversary binder that you get. If you like Dragon Ball Heroes, you can check it out. You can get them on eBay. Uh, I think that's where I got mine. And you get this nice leather binder. And the box, the uh, deck box is actually pretty nice. I think I'll take that to Japan when I go and play. I hope you guys enjoyed this trip. I'm checking out the 11th anniversary Dragon Ball Heroes uh, binder box and cards. I am a dentist. I can't end without doing a dental tooth tip. My dental tooth tip to you would be make sure to make sure to go for regular checkups. A lot of stuff that becomes a problem in dentistry, you don't really feel it just because your teeth feel okay doesn't necessarily mean everything's okay. A lot of these things don't actually hurt you until they're a really big problem. So I'd recommend going to your dentist and going up for a checkup, seeing what's going on. Make sure you're doing all the right stuff with your brushing and flossing and hygiene routine and uh, just take care of yourself because your teeth are very valuable and they do a lot of work for you. So it's good to do some work for them. I'm Joku DMD and I'll see you guys next time.